Hello all, this video is on reading data from holding registers of an NPK sensor using RS-485 Modbus communication. Here we will be using RS-485 to USB dongle like this. The connection is simple. The DC supply is 12 volt for the NPK sensor. Plug in the NPK sensor onto the target soil. The soil should be slightly wet for better results. The RS-485 to USB has got only two wires, A and B. B is always blue wire and the A is yellow wire. Plug into PC and then note down the COM port allotted to this uh, device. That is CS340 driver should be installed previously. We will be using RS485 sensor configuration tool and the link is given in the description below. Download it and open it and select the soil, nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium 3 in 1 and then verify the image. Uh, that uh, NPK image will appear on the top. Select the port, correct port, and then the baud rate is 9600. And then click on connect. There is also option to change the baud rate and uh, device address to at the right hand side. And once you uh, click on connect, you can see the data flowing in. That is a N value, P value, and the K value, all uh, provided as uh, decimal values in mg per kg. The query data is sent as an array of hex code and the result is converted from hex to decimal and displayed, finally displayed. At the right hand side bottom you can see the hex code being sent. Now let us analyze the hex code. Uh, now click on disconnect and then at the right hand side bottom copy the hex code sent and then paste it onto a notepad and separate all the three hex codes the array of hex codes sent for n p and k values that is the three set of uh, hex code arrays the 0x01 is the device address and 03 is the command that is a reading holding registers and then two bytes 0010 is the starting address and then 0001 is the number of uh, registers to read and finally the cyclic redundancy check code two bytes same way for uh, phosphorus and potassium the address will change 1e 1f and 20 now let us use the q mod master that is a freeware to read the holding registers you can read directly the data from the holding registers so open the q mod register and then uh, from options mod select mod bus rtu and set the serial port that is the serial port allotted to the usb to rs485 baud rate is 9600 and then uh, mod modbus mode is rtu slave address is one and the scan time is uh, millisecond thousand milliseconds and from option settings select the base address as zero this is very important and then ndn as bing and then click on ok the start address is uh, 001E that is the start address is the address of the uh, nitrogen value that is in hex and then the function code this is very important select it as 0x03 which is the function code for uh, reading holding registers in Modbus uh, uh, protocol and then the number of registers is 1 as we are going to read only the one value of nitrogen and the data format is decimal so it will directly uh, display in decimal and then from under command click on read write after connecting you now you will get the directly the nitrogen value at the address 0x1e as in previous uh, uh, configuration tool we found the same value so this is red now change the start address to 1f which is the address of the phosphorus 1f now number of registers is 1 and click on command read write you will get the phosphorus value same way change the value start address to 20 0x20 you will get the uh, potassium value so this is individual register reading now let us read all the three registers that is starting from start address 001e next is 1f and the third one is 20 so start address is 1e and number of registers let us provide as 3 so you will get 3 positions and uh, after clicking on command read write you get the 
NPK values directly. So uh, nitrogen, potassium, uh, phosphorus and potassium, all the three values directly read from the holding registers. Also you can read the uh, from the start address 0100 and then number of registers 1. If you click on uh, command read write, you get 1 which is the uh, device address. Same way, the change the start address to 0101 and then the number of registers 1, click on read write, you get 2 which means the baud rate is 9600. This is how to read the holding registers directly from the NPK sensor through Modbus protocol. Thank you for watching.